सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल एंड आई एम बैक विद थर्ड चैलेंज इन 30 डेज ऑफ रिएक्ट जावा स्क्रिप्ट सो वी हैव दिस प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट वी हैव टू क्रिएट रिएक्ट कंपोनेंट दैट इंक्रीमेंट्स अ काउंटर व्हेन अ बटन इज क्लिक्ड बट द मेन थिंग इज दैट वी हैव टू क्रिएट दिस कंपोनेंट विदाउट द यूज ऑफ यूज स्टेट और अ क्लास स्टेट इन रिएक्ट जावा स्क्रिप्ट सो इफ यू आर कंप्लीटली न्यू टू माय चैनल देन मेक श्योर टू लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल सो दैट यू डोंट मिस ऑसम वीडियोस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थिंक बाय योरसेल्फ दैट व्हिच हुक कैन बी यूज्ड टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम एंड ट्राई टू सॉल्व दिस इशू so i hope that you all have tried so we will create a react arrow functional component export now we will use use ref for this challenge because use ref can be used to target a particular dom element okay so we have to import this use ref from react and now we will create a variable which is a counter ref which will take the reference from use ref and initial value is to be 0 now we will create a h1 and inside h1 we will pass counter ref dot current so it will give the initial value of the user which is 0 okay so now now we have to create a button which is increment we will pass on click handler which is handle click and now we will define the handle click const handle click is equal to javascript arrow function which will increase the counter ref dot current from plus equals to 1 okay so whenever the button is clicked it will increase the counter from 1 so if i show you you will see we have this current value and we have the increment so when i click the increment you can see it is not working it is because of use ref does not cause react to re-render so for that we have to force re-render the react so for that we can use the use state we are not using use state for handle counter purpose we are using for it to re-render the component so if i remove the initial state and set the final state to set force render and we will pass a empty object so we have to pass a set force render inside the handle click so whenever user will click on the handle click button it will call the set force render so the purpose of this line is that when you want to force a re-render of a component without changing the actual state Okay so the idea is that when you need to trigger a re-render you can call set force render to update the state with new empty object so this is something which we can use okay so by this if i save the file and go to my screen you will see if i click on increment it will increment the counter so this is something which we can use so we have used the use state for re-rendering the component okay and we are manipulating the counter value with the help of use ref So if you like the video make sure to subscribe and I will meet in the next challenge so thank you for watching